a lot of football manager which got me thinking i watch soccer i mean football all the time but i'm either never able to remember these players because i'm watching a game or said i have to go to website and i'm too lazy to do that however i also realized that python has selenium which is a web crawler that is able to return information in a website and so i thought i could learn python while trying to create something that might keep me motivated so i decided to create a program that would be able to search and return information about a player now that I got that cleared up, I want to start off by trying to jot down some requirements for this program. So here are some of the basic requirements I've written down. I'm going to get to some basic research about the website and how it works. I forgot to hit record, but I did get a little bit done with the search. You are now able to search for a player by their first and last name. It takes a while, but after that it seems to work really well. It's able to display all the players' names on the page. After that, I thought it was better if the user was just able to input an integer to select the player. And I got to adding that in. Now to start off with some actual web crawling, I made a very bad mistake of using XPaths for these which I realized on the next day. For those who don't know, XPaths are basically sentences but are separated by the HTML tags. For instance, if there was a heading 1 tag inside a div tag which was inside a body tag which was inside an HTML tag, the XPath would be HTML slash body slash div slash h1. And that's how it basically works. But either way, I enjoy the fast footage of me screwing up. I also want to mention that the only reason it seems to work right now is because I was using the same player, Cal Felix. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but for the test, I realized this later on. And so when you see this working on the stage, it's really not working. So here you can start seeing me understand that expats were only able to work if the player is a new arrival, which how Felix and Cancelo both are. After about one hour of footage or about three hours of real life coding, I finally realized that I should be using find element by CSS selector or class name. And the reason for that is simple. Most websites don't won't name their class names the same, and even if they do, you're able to separate it. There are still a ton of errors that are gonna pop up, but that's because I did something wrong with the find element, but the concept behind it is correct.
here's the final version and I'm pretty happy with it. Here you can see I'm searching for Son and it returns me with the list of players that was on the first page. I'm going to select the second one and it returns me the information about this player. This channel has a Patreon page and I'll assume that if you watch until here you seem to be enjoying the video. You can head over to that Patreon page and support the channel there. If you guys enjoyed this video, there's a handy like button under this video. Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon to not miss any of the videos in the future and I'll see you guys in the next video.